If your Sunday setlist has one song in E flat and you still want to use those open strings for your chord voicings or lead lines, you don't need to bring a second guitar. With your Line 6 device, you have a digital cable readily available that doesn't take up too much DSP and doesn't sound fake. Let's get to it. Playing guitar with its fixed intervallic tuning is tricky business. Some riffs are dependent on those open strings to provide a pedal tone, so as soon as you transpose the song to anything non-diatonic to the open strings, you're in trouble. A popular workaround is bringing two guitars, one in E standard and the other in E flat standard. But bringing two guitars for three songs for the Sunday service is not practical, certainly not good for an aging back. And if you're watching this video, I'm assuming you already play a Line 6 device, in which case our solution is in the digital domain. As of firmware 3.0, the Helix and HX Storm have effects like the poly pitch and poly capo, which can shift the pitch for the entire guitar up and down several semitones without artifacts. But these effects are DSP intensive and the particle does not have them. The answer? The Simple Pitch Block. A lead developer from Line 6 responsible for the Simple Pitch Block has shared that it works okay as a digital capo for simple intervals, which fits the bill for most worship songs. Here's looking at you, Israel Hewton. Here are my tips to getting it to sound right as a digital capo. Tip number one, put this first in your signal chain and have a compressor after to ensure the shifted notes are even and smooth. Tip number two, set the Simple Pitch Block at 100% mix, 100% shift, and configure it to plus minus up to two semitones. Remember, this only works at milder settings. Tip number three, use EQ if necessary to bolster the low end if found lacking, especially if you're setting it at the upper end of two semitones. All in. That's it, three simple tips which resulted in the tones you just heard. Just don't expect this to work as a baritone guitar converter or playing that D flat at 9 sharp 11. <laughs>
what about you? What have you done in case you forgot to bring your cable to church? Do you bring a spare guitar for those songs in E flat, A flat, D flat, and G flat? I love to hear your stories, ideas, and thoughts in the comment section below. That's it for me. Thanks for watching this video. Here on my channel, I'm committed to helping you get the best tone out of your gear as well as playing your best for the Sunday service. If you're a worship musician on the same journey, consider liking, subscribing, hitting that bell icon, and sharing this video with someone whom you know could benefit. Like what you're hearing in today's tones? If you'd like to see how I crafted them, I made a previous video walking you through my process in tweaking the default M cap selection on a new Pot Gold preset. It was a self-imposed challenge to see how much tonal mileage I could get out of the default M cap. So see you there. Until next time, I'm Justin, and I'm all about worship guitar.